He turned down admission to a prestigious arts high school to focus on football. Geno Smith tested gifted as a child and excelled at creating visual art. He was a four-star recruit coming out of high school and chose to attend West Virginia over schools like Alabama and Clemson. Smith became the team starter in his sophomore season and broke out his junior year. In his senior season, he was on track to win the Heisman, but the Mountaineers struggled as a team. Geno was projected to be a top 10 pick in the 2013 draft, but fell all the way to the second round. In his rookie season, he passed for over 3,000 yards, but threw 12 touchdowns and 20 interceptions. During his second season, he was benched early on, but he bounced back with a perfect passer rating in the Jets' final game. Things looked like they were headed in a positive direction for Geno's third pro year, but during the preseason, a teammate punched him in the face, which fractured his jaw. Geno was out a handful of weeks and Fitzpatrick took over the starting job, but never gave it back. When Geno was finally named a starter again midway through the following season, he tore his ACL in the first game. He then went on to be a backup for six years before finally winning Comeback Player of the Year in 2022.